Hey, this is not a real person. Neither is this. Or this. Or this. And that is just one of the functionalities of HeyGen. So if I go to create a video and click on avatar video, let's just say I want to create a landscape one. Not only do I have access to all of these different avatars, but for each avatar, I can also have them in different settings. Now, if I click on template, here we can see that I can create my own presentations with my avatar speaking. So for example, I can give them an entire script here and then change or alter this presentation as needed. I can even go here to the script and within here, I can change all of the different voices of this person. So for example, if I want to change the voice with, to a different accent, for example, I can do that. Maybe I want someone speaking with a Indian accent. So here are all the different characters that I have available. And say I click this one. Hello, this is how I sound. Hope you. And this is what I can make my character talk like. Now, under elements here, I can add in different elements. If I want to maybe add some music to make this audio a little bit or the presentation a little bit more soothing, I could do that as well. Now, all of this is just one bucket of HeyGen. Now we have all of these other things that we can do here as well. If we click here on create video, we can also do video translation. So what I'm going to do is I'm simply going to upload a video of me talking and I'm going to translate that video in a couple of different languages to see what that looks like. أنا في الحقيقة لا أعرف ما أقوله الآن. كل ما أعرفه هو أني سأقول الكثير من الأشياء. شين تشو ميغا كيميتي سوري كارا شيغوتو ني إيكي ماشتا. شيغوتو وا كانالي يوي إيجيتزو ديشتا. شوتو إي سامبو وشي ماشتا. Some other stuff that you can do is that you can create your own clone and this is what it would look like. Um, you can upload whatever images and then from the images it can create an avatar for you. So you can create your own avatar just like a photo one or a video one. And then here we can also create, write prompts to create an avatar as well. So there are a bunch of different things that we can do um, from the, in this platform. Now, if you click on labs, you, you'll see here that I have a video podcast. So similar to Notebook LLM, except this one also has video integration. I think that's pretty cool. Um, you can see a bunch of different other things like interactive avatars. So this is something that I've tried before where you're kind of talking to a real life person in a Zoom call. So the way that it would work is you would select whatever template, say that you have uh, maybe a therapist here. What you would do is you can give it your own knowledge base, for example, uh, you can select whatever language you want them to be speaking in, and then you can start a new chat or chat with them on Zoom. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create my own avatar. And then here I'm gonna create a new knowledge base. So let's create a new one. Let's say that this is supposed to be my therapist. And then I can give it an intro. So I can either just generate it from some prompt like uh, you are my therapist. Now here I can give it some information about all of my prior sessions, right? Maybe a Google Drive with all of the links from my past conversations, those kind of things. And then in my prompt, I can really specify exactly how I want this person to talk to me with. Now, I can also see all of these different other um, knowledge bases that are available. So let's try one. Let's try to have a conversation with this uh, programming coach. So here I'm going to chat in Zoom. Open Zoom meeting. Join. And then Recording join with computer in audio. Hey, Eleanor, how's it going? Hi. I'm Eleonora. Now, by this point, you're probably wondering, well, how much does all of this cost? Well, there is a free option where you pay zero and you can create up to three videos per month. You can only create them up to three minutes. So that one's not that great. The creator plan, I think that one is a little bit more worth. Uh, you can create unlimited videos. However, there's a limit of up to five minutes, but you can always create a five minute video and then add it to another five minute video. Um, there is this Teams one, which I personally don't think that it's really going to be worth it unless you really want to create your own custom video avatar. Uh, and then there's a enterprise one. So I don't know if this is going to be the best tool that you have available for something like this, but this is the best one that I've encountered so far. If you know of a better tool, then please leave a comment in the comment section below and I'll be sure to cover it. That's it for this video. Thank you all for tuning in. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.